So we're in the car, heading on our big journey. Maid is up front, she's coming along with us. Hulika's in the back, managing all the birds. Cassie's way in the back there, I don't know if you can see her. See some ears there. <laughs> it's an overcast day. When we left home there, it was really raining. It's okay, it's a travel day, so no problem. I'll hand the camera over to Kulika on the back. So I'll show you the setup there of how the birds are, are traveling. So here's the setup. There is a cage for peach and cherry. They have a perch for each and uh, food and water over there. It's quite comfortable. And uh, here we have little crow and uh, and uh, little pie. <laughs> Yeah, these are just our travel cages. So we have uh, bigger cages w uh, with us in the back. So once we get there, we're gonna put them in bigger cages so they'll be very comfortable. So it's about a 13 hour trip. We already got one hour down. So about 12 hours to go yet. There's the border ahead. Two red poles. We're leaving Saskatchewan and entering Alberta, guys. What an ugly cloud over there. Your crow is in the back. It's like a real petting zoo in this car. So we just left Lloyd and Kulika picked up some mealworms for the birds. The little crow is gonna have a little bit of that. <laughs> Peach and cherry. They're happy to have those snacks. Those are premium snacks for birds. We're probably gonna get there guys to Last Lake in the dark. It's like 13 hours and we had a big pit stop there. What can you do? We have a whole week ahead though, we're gonna have a lot of fun. We're pulling into Edmonton, Alberta. It's been about six hours since we left the house. We had that break in Lloydminster. We're gonna do another pit stop and then we have another 500 kilometers north before we get to the guest house. What a trip. Yeah, we stopped in Edmonton here. We need to have another pit stop. Kulik is feeding the chicks again. <laughs> Guys, we're getting close. Yeah, and I forgot. This is northern Alberta. It's not Saskatoon. Back home, it would be dark right now. So that's what I was thinking. But way up north here, the sun's up longer. Wow. Yeah, we're just about ready to turn in and you'll see the property. How are you doing back there, Kulika, with the birds? Uh, we're getting more and more excited as we're getting closer. <laughs> yeah. Almost 1,100 kilometers, guys. That's 660 miles. We're pretty tired. We're also hungry. So, just about there. We're pulling in. Can't believe it. It's a familiar sight. Kulika was riding the quad on these trails last year. We're gonna try and get that quad again. I don't know though if they're gonna let us use it or not. We sure, we sure hope so. Here we are. Don't mind all the bugs on the windshield. They came in the last hour or so, these bugs. Yeah, you were here last year, Cassie. I'm sure Cassie remembers. Look at the car here, all packed. Cassie had a nice spot there though. Let's go take a look at the birds. There's peach and cherry. And there's pie. Don't know if you can see them. <laughs> Over there's little crow. We had them packed nicely here. Yeah. These bad boys tipped the water dish over a little while ago. <laughs> Cassie, you're happy to be here? Yeah, we're gonna play ball and everything. You're gonna have a lot of fun. Lots of fun for Cassie. 300 acre property, it's all ours for a week. And there's a cabin down in that direction, a wilderness cabin. And here we're gonna have many fires going. We'll do some cookouts and we'll do the cowboy cookout too.
So we're finally here, hey Kulaga? Yeah, I'm so excited to be here. Wow, it just feels like we were here yesterday. It was one year ago <laughs> we were here, guys. Can't believe it has been a full year. <laughs> yeah, and uh, you saw the video before this one. I put that link to the cookout there, the cowboy cookout. So hopefully some of you watched it that didn't see it before. So let's go do a tour of the house. There's the pup. Maid is in the house already. She's sitting down in the living room. But now we're going to do the tour. Call the pup in. We don't want to let a bunch of mosquitoes in for the birds. Look at this. It's beautiful. It's a nice guest house. Here's the dining area. So it's a nice rustic table. I love those rustic There's a kitchen. I'll show you from a different angle here. Look at that. So nice. And it's still light out. I wish it was our house. <laughs> Nice supply of firewood. There's Maida in the living room. Nice big living room. Let's take a look. There's a TV if, if it's raining or something. There's the piano. I said I'd play a tune last year. I still don't know how to play. <laughs> Pop's doing a tour too. There's the bathroom. Here's the bedroom on the main level. Nice size bedroom. There's the pup. No sleeping on bed, pup. <laughs> no sleeping on the bed. There's even another level. Let's go up there. That's why we come here, guys. It was a long drive, but it's worth it. And check this out. Another bedroom up here. Another bedroom. That's nice. And another washroom. Yeah, a bathroom. Yeah. And this one here, the light doesn't work. I tried to turn it on, but. Isn't this nice, guys? That's why we come here. That's why we put 13 hours on the road. Yeah. Oh, it's so nice here. There's so much to do outdoors. All the cookouts we'll have and the hiking. And, oh, I just can't wait. So we had a little house tour. Now we'll get the birds in and we'll show you when they're all set up. And then we're gonna have a little dinner. And it's getting pretty late. We're tired, of course, from that long drive. So let's go get the birds. Thought I'd feed the pup first. Then I'll show you the birds in the house they're set up. Guess what time it is now, guys? It's quarter after 11. It's 11.15 p.m. Look how light it is yet. Isn't that amazing? Back home in Saskatoon, I'm sure it's dark. Pitch dark. <laughs> it's amazing. Wow, you can do a lot here. You'd think it's earlier than it actually is. That's a cozy house there too. Really gonna enjoy it here. So Kulika's just setting up the bird cages and then we'll show you. But I just wanted to show you how light it is yet. Wow. There's a happy pup, guys. She's happy to be on holidays. I'll throw the frisbee. <laughs> I'll throw it, Cassie. Go get it. <laughs> you can really fling it. <laughs> that frisbee really goes. So here's the setup, guys. <laughs> there's Little Crow up there. And there's Pie. Hello, Pie. <laughs> Hi, Pie. And Peach and Cherry in this cage. <laughs> what a setup. <laughs> what a setup. Like, their own condominiums. <laughs> Each one has their own uh, bedroom. See, uh, Peach and Cherry are sherry, but they're used to sherry. So. so we brought this cage in the back of the car. We folded this and packed that. And we brought this one. And that was the travel cage that Peach and Cherry was in. And then uh, mm -hmm. Pie and, and Little Crow, they were in those little pet carriers. So isn't that nice? <laughs> nice fresh uh, birch tree branches. Yeah, nice. Yeah, look at that. That brought some bark for them to find. 
What a nice setup, guys. What do you think? <laughs> Little pie. They're gonna have fun here. Look at this. We made a pork roast and potato salad, and then we we hauled it all here. So, yeah, we're we're pretty worn out after this day, but we're happy to be here. So we're gonna end this video now, guys. We're gonna have a lot of fun here on this trip. You're gonna see many videos. So thanks for watching, and if you're new here, please subscribe so you can get to see these videos coming out. And also the notification bell. Don't forget to click that.